Well, we don't have moose in Evansville, but there are moose in the U.S. You got in the U.S. I mean, in the Philippines, we don't have this. In the Philippines, you have giant bats that look like people. And they're like massively huge. Hi, Filipino Wife Abroad. You are watching this channel. Hello, how are you doing? I am fine with Chris, our cameraman. Well, I have a new upload for you guys. It's just, you know, a part of my family. Of course, it's a foreign wife. I gotta take care every member of my house and that is this time Ginto. So um, this segment is for him and you know, he has been a part of my, uh, you know, my channel. And you know, you saw him from being a puppy, the time we got him from Illinois and until today. And uh, you know, he, he is already one year old. So this video is just all about uh, changing, you know, his dog tag. So originally, yeah, this is his dog tag. And his name is Ginto. Yeah, for the record, Ginto means gold in Tagalog. In my language, in my country, Philippines. So, it's Ginto. But my husband said Ginto. Alright, so this is his color and this is his dog tag again. And we gotta change this because, you know, my Ginto is feeling uncomfortable now. It is really tight for him. Okay, so we're gonna go to PetSmart. Yeah, they have this um, laser engraving machine. Uh, we're just gonna show you how you operate it. Well, of course, um, when I was in the Philippines, I had my dog, actually it's a street dog, and I'm loving it, you know? And I didn't have any color for him, and nor, you know, the uh, dog tag. So it's, it's new to me, and it was really fun. So you can see that video after this, uh, you know, sh short speech. <laughs> All right, so here we gotta put Ginto here the name and of course the address okay our address so Chris is it important like, to put um address well sure if the police or somebody picks them up they know where to bring them back to yes well guys here in America having a dog is really a full of responsibility of of course the host me and it's just I'm really surprised when I got here how important having or taking care of the dog. It's not just you're going to take a dog and your pet. It's your family. At first, I was not taking it seriously, you know. It's just pet, you know. And I love my dog. Don't get me wrong. I'm super, super dog lover. But the level of the passion and the love, you know, of Americans, you know, towards dog is just really amazing, you know. In fact, we already had a segment about our dilemma. Uh, whether we're gonna take Ginto to the Philippines or not in two to three years. So anyway, we already decided that we're gonna fly him. He's gonna fly guys, and you know what? His fare is really much more expensive than I than I have. So you know, he's really incorrigible, hard-headed, but we love him. He's really the joy in this house. Yeah, that's all. So we're gonna go there and we're gonna get this done. It is really exciting because because the first time I did this, um, you know, Chris did it. Um, yeah, I was not really that excited as I am right now. So you do not only see, of course, how we engraved, of course, the name or the dog tag. Uh, you can also see, uh, yeah, the other toys of Ginto. Like we spend a lot of money on his, uh, you know, toy. Like we buy, you know, two two times a week. But you know, he's a part of our budget. He's a family member, you know. And what do the toys do? Yes, and. Well, 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 yes, I'm already convinced. Uh, I noticed that when a dog, just like a kid at home, uh, when a kid has a lot of toys, you know, playing, this child growing up becoming smarter. Yes, so our dog, I noticed, like he's really getting smarter and smarter day by day, you know? He's just sometimes, he's, he's just outsmarting us. <laughs> He's so hard-headed, it really surprises me, and he becomes, you know, a thinker, so I can really notice that through his toys. Yeah, that's all for today, guys, um, but not really that special, but of course, as a foreign wife, I got experience like this kind of thing, which I did not before, and it's just really fun, and I just really hope that I can really share it with you, especially those Filipina who are moving here and, uh, you know, considering to get a dog. It's not an easy responsibility because you got to consider a lot of things. Even sending out your dog outside is really as much as possible a no-no without your leash and without under supervision. 
All right, so that's all for today. And I hope that you're gonna like this video. And don't forget to subscribe to Filipina Wife Abroad. Thank you all and have a nice day. All right, you need the receipt. And the activation code is here. So, T. T. We want the front, thank you. You want to go back, you skipped over a previous screen. The front, you want to do the front first. Uh, front is Ginto, right? Right. Okay. Now we want to put Ginto Abel. Ginto Abel. Next line. Six three zero. Oh. You want your phone number or mine? Put your phone number. Eight one whatever your phone number is. Eight, one, two. We didn't use my phone. 502. Okay. 502. Continue. Press continue again if you're okay. Begin to angle. Close door. Engrave. And then it should move inside. This is what they like. market day again and see what we got for Ginto one more time here it's of course it's a bunny um the first bunny that we gave him was really um, much better and it was really cute and it looked so real and good thing is that it is still in good shape so he still loves that bunny so this time we're giving this one and you know he loves chasing bunny like real bunny over there and uh, yes this is this is hard the texture is hard and i think there's no squeaker inside this bunny 
yeah, very tough. So I don't think that he can tear this apart, which, you know, he normally does. All right, so that's it. He can't wait. Look at how excited he is. See? Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Hey, guys. So it's market day again today. And what we've got for him right now is this one. Um, what is this? What kind of bird is this? And I think I'm giving Ginta like for 10 minutes, you know. This would really look fun for him. It's so exciting for him and he cannot really, you know, look at him. Look how excited he is. As usual, here it is. Right, so we got another new toy, of course, for him because I think every toy is not lasting, you know. So the other time I gave him the last, like I think it was kind of duck and it lasted like for 10 minutes. Oh my goodness. And uh, so this is very soft and a lot of, you know, squeaker inside this. Um, you know, this is the dog's trophy to take out the uh, squeaker inside and they're done, you know. And I guess um, with this quality, it looks actually very durable. The fabric is really tough here, but I'm not really sure of the feather. I think he's gonna tear up the, um, well, the uh, horn. <laughs> so I'm going to get the tag first, okay guys? All right, so I just removed the tag and this is ready for, you know, for his sentence. <laughs> Good luck to you. I'm very, I'm very sorry. All right, so let's go. Huh? Stop! Stop! What animal is this? It's a moose. Ah! Uh, ah! Uh, uh. Moose? It's a moose. We don't have moose. Oh, uh, see? Well, we don't have moose in Evansville. They're just in the U.S. Yeah, in the U.S. I mean, in the Philippines, we don't have this. Ginda, stop. In the Philippines, you have giant bats that look like people. And they're like massive. Can I have this? Yeah, that's your cat. Hey, hey, hey. hey. Uh huh. Yeah. <laughs> oh my goodness. So it's market day again today and of course as usual so we got chipmunks so cute very adorable except for our ginto is not yeah the moose is still you know still okay and still healthy still alive and he cannot really tear that apart and i think that really upsets him but this time i am really sure that he's gonna kill this because he can't you know this looks really similar to the squirrel the tree and the bunny there yeah so they're always racing look all right so i'm gonna remove the price tag mm, the texture is similar to the um, bunny that we showed you last time and the bunny is still alive and so healthy and i cannot you know and he cannot really tear that apart so easily so for sure this will last but this is really cuter than the bunny all right so let me remove first the tag okay, so this is it guys so he is ready so look at him he's so impatient i'm very sorry guys he's just very rude and you know just such a brat canadian um golden retriever yes and he's uh -uh. hey Uh, My new favorite bit. Uh, mm -hmm. uh, Show off. Uh, Show you. No, don't you dare. Wow, have you ever seen these pretty stripes? See that is a beautiful stripe, don't you think? Hey, this side has one. Don't you dare. Okay. 